You're called an activist. That's quite an adjective nowadays. When you hear this term, what do you think about? Uh, think about picking another job. <laughs> um, no, the, the answer is I think uh, a very interesting presentation uh, from uh, Matt from, from BlackRock. And BlackRock is a uh, built a business largely on passive strategies and uh, you know phenomenal business. The vast majority of the capital markets today, the public cap capital markets, the investors are passive. Uh, you know they're indexed, uh, they're closet indexed, uh, they're indexed plus an alpha strategy. And if you look at the shareholder list of major companies, it's BlackRock, it's Fidelity, it's Cap Research, um, it's Vanguard, uh, and and by chart of these institutions are passive. If you think about capitalism, you know, hundred years ago it was very different, right? You had Carnegie, you had J.P. Morgan, you had uh, you know players who'd buy big stakes in businesses. They were control shareholders. There was an owner on the board of directors. So so capitalism over time has democratized, uh, which I think is great for accessibility to. Uh, you know, the average man in terms of investing in the market, but you, you get rid of owners uh, controlling uh, companies. And I think uh, what activists do is they're sort of, they represent other shareholders. You know, if you think back to uh, my friend Mr. Icon in the 80s, he operated very differently. Uh, today, uh, an activist shareholder takes a stake in a business and is only successful if all of the shareholders benefit. It's not green mail where the, the activist investor buys a stake, gets a benefit for himself and moves on. Uh, you know, if you take a stake in Canadian Pacific Railroad and other people follow you in and they vote in your uh, directors and a new CEO comes in and the stock does well, you know, it, the, the shareholders benefit collectively. So it's yeah. a, I think it's a very valuable feature for the market. If the shareholders don't support the activists, it never gets done. And yeah. we're not a control investor. We're a lead investor. We're leading the charge on behalf of other uh, shareholders.